Don Hemingway stars Jude Law and Jude Law. This is Jude Law's film. It's his tour de force and he's never actually Jude Law in the film. He's always just this character, Don. I had to keep reminding myself that it was Jude Law I was watching. <laughs> uh, but now also starring uh, Richard E. Grant, who looks a lot like Christopher Walken. It should have been Christopher Walken in the film actually. Um, Demian Bichur and Emilia Clarke from Game of Thrones. Uh, it's directed by Richard Shepard, who's done a number of other gritty independent films which look really good. Uh, and it's from the producer of a film, Sexy Beast, which I haven't actually seen, but I've seen another film from either the director, the producer, or the writer of it or something called 44 Inch Chest, which was awesome. A very simple plotted film, it essentially all takes place in just one location, but the acting and the uh, character development amongst all the, all the people in it is just sublime. So Dom, played by Law, of course, uh, just got out of prison for 12 years and he's greatly determined to take back some money owed to him, uh, beat some people up, get very drunk, do a lot of coke, and basically just engage in rampaging debauchery. And that's your film. <laughs> and it's almost endlessly entertaining from start to finish. The very first scene will definitely not sit well with many viewers, uh, myself to a small extent. Uh, Jude Law sort of performs a very long monologue, uh, that's, that's all I'll say. Uh, but this film just soars in a great way. It's almost hard to define the genre, it's not exactly a straight up crime gangster film. It is a black comedy. It's almost like a two-bit British version of The Wolf of Wall Street, but it's really good though. As for performances, this is Jude Law as you've never seen him before. Uh, Law is always that sort of nice, charming British guy that, that, that you're always happy to see. You're like, yeah, hey, hey, this guy, Jude Law. <laughs> but here, he is one nasty, scummy piece of trash. I've been meaning to check out another British film called Filth with James McAvoy, which looks like a similar premise and a similar character. Most of the time, you're kind of hoping Dom will be plucked off by the end, but uh, then he gets himself into a very sticky and intense situation with gangsters, and you're actually pulling and sympathising for him. Uh, but, but then in the end, you're kind of just wanting him dead again, but, uh, but, but you get my point, because of Jude Law's charismatic yet despicable performance on every level, uh, there is a bit where you're actually pulling for him. Cool. In conclusion to Dom Hemingway, it's by absolutely no means for everybody, but it's the best I've ever seen Law. The film in general is entertaining as hell, the dialogue is very darkly funny, Richard E. Grant is also quite funny in the film. Uh, the start and the end just could have been done better, uh, but the film is still a solid 9 out of 10. It's a 4.5 out of 5, it's a 90% film, just 5% at the start and 5% at the end just didn't really work for me. Feel free to comment on this video guys, tell me anything you want about Dom Hemingway, uh, subscribe if you wish, uh, it won't do you any harm. It really probably won't do you any good either. But uh, yeah, that's it for me for now. I'll see you next time.